Hey guys, Dr. Sandy with your, um, just giving you an update, man, just, just about life. This is like a bonus video. So I'm really excited to say that um, I wanted to do something kind of stretching myself, getting a little uncomfortable, and I, I believe you should always be changing things up, um, reinventing yourself just to keep it exciting. I'm the kind of guy, man, I mean, like, let's change it up, let's make it awesome. So what I did today for years, I've been working out at home. Um, I decided to change it up. So I did join a gym just today. Went to a local uh, Good Life, and I was just going to say the experience I had today was incredible. Very, very friendly staff. Um, just showed the facilities, gave tons of options on how to approach it. So Good Life, I would definitely give a thumbs up. And uh, yeah, I, I think you just want to change yourself. And every time I make these videos, I want to really make it clear I'm going on a journey. I'm learning. I'm growing. I haven't got everything perfected, and you know, just trying to grow and learn it. I want to be on that journey with you, but. You know, if you're listening to this and you're going to a gym and maybe you feel like you're tired of it, maybe it's time to, you know, work out at home if time's an issue. If you've been working out at home for a while and you're looking at a gym like I was, maybe it's time to look for a gym. And I think Good Life, you know, just starting, let's see how it goes forward. So far, it's been great. But any gym, you know, any gym that works for you, I think if I could give you a tip, look for a gym that's really close and then look for the energy, look for the vibe. Like, you know, I think sometimes when we're shopping, and it depends on your personality, some people are like, okay, I am just going to go to the cheapest gym, I don't care about anything, um, and you know, that that's a way to do it as well, uh, but I'm the kind of person like, you know, you got to look for what you're paying and what you're getting, so, you know, if I can find a gym where I've learned in the past, I've gone to gyms, and I was just like, oh my god, it was dark, I, I didn't feel inspired, um, this location near my house it's uplifting, upbeat, good energy, good music. I personally don't like a gym with way too many TVs, which I've seen in the past. So it feels like you're there to focus. A lot of bright colors. There's sunlight. That's a big thing for me as well. I've been in gyms where it's completely like a box, no sunlight coming in. So look at all those factors. Of course, you want to look at price as well, but um, price is part of the picture. But how's the vibe? How's the environment? Is it close to my house? Can I get there within minutes? The gym I just timed it today. I kind of have a schedule now, I'll drop my kids to school. It's like less than 10 minutes, which is perfect. In and out, my goal is about half an hour, but look at all those variables. Look at location, look at price, obviously. Look at the facility and look at if that place inspires you. So, and like I said, if you love your gym, great. If you need to change it up, <coughs> something you can look into. So, um, yeah, just change yourself, stretch yourself, do something different. Now, here's the thing. When do a lot of people join the gym? Probably, I'm going to guess, highest enrollment is January 1st. I'm looking at my watch and it's like we're in June, right? So, you know, why do we have to wait till New Year's? And I apply that to myself. I'm going to start fresh, going to push myself. And I know there's going to be days where the weather's off and this and off. And, you know, I'm probably going to still work out at home from time to time. But just wanted a change of environment. So, change things up, stretch yourself. I challenge you this week. I just went to a great seminar and as I kind of download stuff, I'll share that with you, but um, change things up, challenge yourself. I'm going to actually challenge you if you're watching this video, do something this week by Sunday that you know you should be doing. Something different, something you've been pushing off. Let's not wait till January 1st. That's like, who knows? That's so far away. So do something this week, you know, something good for you, something positive that you've been holding off and do it by the end of this week. I challenge you, once you do it, write in the comments that you did it. If you like this video, big thumbs up, share it. God bless you. Have a fantastic week and I'll be here again. Thanks.